Met the principals. Now let's turn it over to the horses as they move in behind the starting gate. And here's track announcer Brett Boyd. And here they come. There, off and trotting in Rawhide Rita in the center of the track goes out for the lead. Rompaway Quincy also fires out at the rail as they move into the first turn. V, the lady goes off stride. Rawhide Rita takes over and opens up by two. Along the inside, Rompaway Quincy trots along in second. Moving up on the outside, here comes Courtney's Elegance pressuring up in third. Along the rail, Ben's Delight races in fourth. Along the inside, Caitlin Butch is fifth, Miss Wall Street sixth, PV Star seventh, Viva Lady trails as they motor around the quarter, and it's Courtney's Elegance now sticking a nose in front. The opening quarter in 30 seconds flat. Rawhide Rita trots along at the rail, and now those two fillies stride for stride as they come to the half. Rompaway Quincy is right behind, drafting them in third. Ben's Delight is inching up from fourth. Miss Wall Street tips to the outside fifth. Half down and half to go, and Courtney's Elegance is cleared to the front. Rawhide Reed is coming back to the outside, racing in second. A blazing half of 59 flat, and here comes Miss Wall Street, picking them up and laying them down on the outside third. PV Stars also rolling up as Rompaway Quincy gets shuffled back to fourth, moving to the three quarters, Courtney's Elegance on the inside, Miss Wall Street knocks at her door on the outside second, and along the rail, Rawhide Rita is third, Rompaway Quincy is not done yet in fourth, up the inside, Ben's Delight, as they race by the three quarters in 131, rounding that final turn, Courtney's Elegance digs in at the rail, Miss Wall Street right there on the outside second, and Rompaway Quincy He's coming back for more. Three wide on the outside. Down the stretch. Courtney's Elegance. Miss Wall Street. Up the rail. Rawhide Rita. Through the lane. Courtney's Elegance hanging on. So as the horses enter the stretch, it was Courtney's Elegance on top by two lengths. And she was making up for an earlier break when she just barely qualified in the elimination heat. Courtney's Elegance picks up her eighth win in 16 starts and goes over $45,000 in earnings with Jim Curran in the bike, winning the Michigan Breeders' Futurity. We'll be back with more from the Lenawee County Fair on Michigan We're back Beach. at the Lenawee County Fair in Adrian, Michigan, and Jim Kern has just won the final of the Michigan Breeders' Futurity for three-year-old trotting fillies. That first trip, what happened there? She, she made a break just basically got up to qualify I guess that's all you want to do what, what happened concerned about the draw gate and I don't know she did that the in the yeah the draw gate in the backside she was wanting to go out it and and uh, I showed her the showed her the whip and instead of going she took off running on me right. and, so uh, I guess the game plan then was just to qualify just to qualify but she went such a big trip last week it must have been a disappointment for you then that first heat yeah, yeah I was but I, I you know I knew that you know the finals coming up as long as we're in we got a chance okay well, she's good uh, she is a, a tough mare and we're gonna see you on October the 8th at Hazel Park with Courtney's elegance okay. that's the finals congratulations all right